Good morning everybody, welcome to my creative time with Emma and also welcome to another 3D Wednesday. For today, I had asked my design team to do, we kind of have a theme. I figured since I got married in October and there's a few September anniversaries, lots of November and there's even some December anniversaries out there, I figured I wanted to, and everywhere I turn, people, someone's having a baby. <laughs> so anyways, I thought it would be fun to have my design team create little baby shower favors slash wedding favors. Okay, so we have a little bit of both for you today. Okay, so for my project for today, I decided to go ahead and go with a wedding, um, or a wedding favor, or you could even use it for a wedding shower. But I think this would be really pretty for a wedding favor. Um, so for that, I used my bubblegum treat box. And it's a pretty good size die. And that's what it looks like. So this is what I'm using for the actual favor portion. And then I'm using, this is one of my favorite sets. This is called 100% Sweetness. And I'm using this heart stitched die right here. And I'm using another one of my faves, my rolled flower dies, and I'm using this one here at the top. And then another one of my super favorite. <laughs> this is the teeny tag die, and the one I use, I use the die, you know, which comes with it right there. And the sentiment I use is Mr. and Mrs., okay? So I'm going to quickly show you. Here we go right here. This is the favor right here. So basically... This is what it looks like. I already ran it through my cuddle bug for you. Okay, so what I'm going to do before I put it together, I'm going to put all of my embellishments on here already, okay? So basically, this is the little heart. Oh, and the paper pad I use is an older um, My Mind's Eye paper pad that I had. Um, oh, it's not in front of me at the moment, but um, it's a really pretty one. I love it, but of course you could use any color you want, okay? I know lots of people who have red as their theme when they get married. And I thought this will be pretty, especially for like a little vintage -y type. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and just put that right there. And then my little flower, isn't that pretty? She is going to go, you know what, actually I need to move this over. I have to scooch this over just a tad. Let me see. Hold on. <laughs> Not that that made a huge difference, but it did a little. Okay, so anyways, I put a little bit of bling right there, and I also just added one on the little petal off to the side there. So I'm going to go ahead and just throw some hot glue gun on this um, to, just to keep my little flower in place there. Okie dokie. Oops. And this is just going to go like so. Isn't that pretty already? Very elegant. I mean, it's a... You don't always have to have something white for your wedding. You know what I'm saying? I remember when I got married, I was like, it's got to be white. It's got to... But then after you think about it, you really don't have to. You know what I'm saying? Just something simple and pretty. Okay, so that is that right there. And basically, I already put all my rolled flower dye together and all of that good stuff. So now what I'm going to do, I'm going to go ahead. I'm, You know what? I think I'm just going to use my hot glue gun for this. Or maybe not. Let's see. No, I'm going to use my score tape instead. Okay, and this is it right here. Just some score tape. Or you could use the, let me find the beginning, or you could use some red tape, you know, the little red, red one. Um, let me get some scissors. And I saw this works good with this. You could either use this, you could use zip dry glue, but I don't really feel like waiting for it to dry. So we're just going to keep it simple and use this. This does rip. You could just rip it off, but I want it to kind of be a little bit of neat there. And then let me just put this on here, just like so. I 
All right, so then what I'm going to do, I'm just going to take the little stickers off here. And what I like to do after I go ahead and I get this all down here, I used to, I like to get like a little, um, of course, oh, here we go, right here. I like to get a little bone folder to kind of, um, okay, you see it right there? Just to kind of just seal it down just a little bit more, you know, to kind of like press it down just to make sure it's it's good in there. Okay, so now what I'm going to do, and I'm not going to show this part on camera because um, I my camera is about to die, to be honest with you. I haven't charged it up. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to put these little candies on the inside, the little mini lollipop, and they're from C's Candy. I'm going to stick these on the inside. And then I'm going to close it up, which it just closed just like so. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab my teeny tag, the one I stamped Mr. and Mrs. on. And that's going to go off like so. I figure this is an easier way because you know why? For wedding favors, to be honest with you, oh my God, wedding costs add up like crazy. And I mean, I probably would have thought differently about it now, but hey, um, it's like the printing. I mean, everything is so expensive. So even if you have a little Mr. and Mrs., you don't necessarily have to have it personalized. You don't. You could keep it simple, and I think this is a really pretty favor for a wedding. Um, so anyways, everybody, don't forget to watch the end of the video for um, my card. If you don't see it at the end of the video, go ahead and stop over my blog at www.creativetimeforme.com to go ahead and see the final product and you definitely want to stop by to see what my amazing design team has done okay everybody and also one more thing don't forget I have a challenge going on um, it's called the recycle it it's one of it's another designer challenge that I have going on every other Thursday so it's still going on right now so again if you go to my blog there'll be a link at the bottom to it um, this way you could play along and win and have an opportunity to win some amazing prizes. Okay, everybody, have a fabulous day, and I will see you back here soon. Bye-bye.